Hello everyone, this is Ari from Iris Communication. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can root your Sony Xperia Tipo Duo and Singular cellular phone. Not only root, also how you can install Clockwork Mode CWM to your Sony Tipo Duo and Singular cellular phone. We have to unlock the phone. After that, we have to hit at menu. At menu, we have to find one option is called settings. Hit this one. At the settings, we have to go to one option is called developers option hit this one at developers option you have to activate this usb debugging mode if it's closed hit this one click ok we need few things we need data cable from sony xperia now put this data cable one side we need few software for this two software for routing and one software for installing cwm as you see, I have one folder here. It's called Sony Root. I download in here all the software. So at the video description, you'll have the link. Just click and download all of this. First is Sony PC Companion. Download and install at your PC. After that, you have to download Unlock Root Pro. After download, you have to unzip this one. For this, you will need WinZip WinRAR software. To extract in this folder, make a root folder. After extracting, you will find two files in this. One is the software of ULR, another is Notepad, and one more software you will need. This is CWM installer dot apk. This is one of the apk file. Okay. Now you have to install this one, this Sony PC company. After installing this one, install this one, the root software, PTS, as you see. Hit next. Be careful, check these two options. If it's checked, it's fine. If it's not checked, hit this one for select. Click next. Hit install. It's installing now. Okay, it's done. Hit finish for run the software. Okay. Now, minimize this one. Hit this notepad. Copy this code or password. Click the right button of the mouse. Copy. Close this one. Minimize all. Okay. After pasting that, hit go. And now it's asking you for connect your phone to your notebook or desktop PC or laptop PC, wherever you want. Here is my phone. I will connect via USB connector as you see this one here. Put this phone one side. After that connect the phone to your notebook, desktop PC or laptop PC, wherever you want. Is done and you will see this option at your skin the model number of your phone and the option of root hit this one as you see routing please wait now is asking me permission to give permission for install one software this is battery saver I don't want to do this I click no Okay, as you see, root is done. Now the phone should restart. As you see, the phone is restarting. Okay, here we are. Unlock the phone. Skip. Now we have to check the phone is rooted or not. For this, I will hit menu. At the menu, we have to check super user. As you see, super user is here. So my phone is rooted successfully. If you want to follow the Twitter, you can follow the Twitter. All the system is available here. All the information. 
hit home or menu button now for installing cmw we need to connect the phone back again to the pc and leave the phone one side and now you have to find that downloaded software you download already i think that i was talking about it was this software is cmw installer dot apk hit the right button on this software copy this one minimize this folder hit my computer at windows 8 windows 7 whatever and here you should see your phone as you see sony xperia tipo duo hit this one you will see two options one is internal storage other is sd card hit the sd card option and at the root folder of the sd card you have to click right button and paste that cwm dot apk file as you see cwm installer is paste here it's fine now now you can close this one close everything we are done with the notebook disconnect your phone from the notebook or desktop pc wherever you are now we have to work at phone we have to hit menu at menu i don't have any application for check my file and folders if you don't have any one you can do one thing you can go to play store okay at the play store you have searching button at the top hit this one type file browser file manager or file explorer i click file manager this one is free the first one the file manager hit this one hit for install accept the term and condition is downloading now it's only 2.75 megabyte is installing now one most important thing for downloading anything from android market you need to have a google account if you don't have google account please do that and come back here again okay it's installing now we have to wait a bit it's done it's giving me two options open and answer i'm not going to open from here i will hit home or menu button after that as you see file manager at my desktop or if you're not fine as this hit the menu and as you see file manager here hit this one and we have to find that particular file that we paste at our SD card. Okay. But as you see, cwm installer.apk. That file that I put at my SD card, hit this one. I click package installer for using this application. Now it's giving me options. It's not allow me for install this file. Hit settings. At the security, this option, unknown source, you have to hit this one. Click OK. For activated unknown source is now is fine one more thing i want to show you how you can open this source you have to click at menu hit at settings at settings at security option hit this one and here you see unknown source you have to open this click ok hit at home button or menu button click one more time and file manager ext card and you have to click cwm installer this time package installer hit this one hit for install it's installing now and it's done it's ask me permission done or open i will hit open i will hit as you see this ask me permission for install this one one more time hit install The super user asked me the permission accept or deny hit grant permission cwm is installed is done now i will close the phone for check hit the power button off hit ok the phone is closed i will click the power button for on the phone and i will continuously press premium down key so i can enter into system recovery as you see i'm at the system recovery now you can flash a custom rom you can do whatever you want with your phone you can wipe and do factory reset and hard reset whatever you want you can do with this okay
this is all my friend if you like this video please do subscribe if you have any question leave me as a comment i will try to answer you as much fast as possible as always for more information go to the irs communication www.irscommunication.com have a nice evening ciao